Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In this one we are going to be learning how to add new taxonomies and assign it to trips using WP Travel. Taxonomies are a way of classifying content and data. When you're using a taxonomy, you're grouping similar things together. Similarly, with WP Travel plugin, you will be able to group the trips according to the default taxonomy available in WP Travel plugin. Like for example, trip types, destinations, keywords, and activities. Let me show you really quick. If you head over to trips, here you can see on your right side you have these boxes which are called taxonomies. You can see we have added a few options in here which we are going to to be talking about later in the video and after that you can see trip types and similar options in here after that you have keywords and then you have activities and so on and so forth now if you are wondering how to add new taxonomies and assign it to trip using w travel then please go through this instruction which will be discussed step by step so for the sake of this tutorial we are going to be discussing trip types taxonomy likewise you can apply the same exact process for destination keywords and activities so first of all the trip types is a default taxonomy which comes with the activation of the view travel plugin which displays under the trip sections in the dashboard menu just click it and you can see various fields just pop up now to create a new trip type you have to fill up the available fields for example name plug parent type and the description and also you have an option to add an image related to your trip type okay so allow me to really quickly add some information here and I'll catch you in a moment. So over here you can see I have filled up all of the information and down here I have also added an image. So you can see this blue add new trip type and when you click it you can see the newly added trip type will be listed on the right hand side of the page. So now if we head back to a trip, the trip type which have been created will be displayed on the right hand side of the individual trip page. To assign the trip type you have to check on this little checkbox in front of our added trip type and this will be totally according to your personal preference. Okay, so now we are basically done and let's just head over to the front end page and see what so far we have added and how is it looking. On the front end page, you can see under the trip type our added a cruise trip is being displayed nicely. The point to be noted here is you can add any number of trip types as per your requirement. There is no limit and you can do what suits you the best. Now, let me show you another really quick way to add the trip type. So here you can see under the trip types, you have this add new trip type option when you click it it prompts up you with two fields and here you can add the title for example holiday and you can also select a parent type if you want to do so once you're done you can click on this add new trip type and you can see immediately our trip type is added but the only drawback of this is that you have only two fields to add options in here you do not have an option to add a picture you can head back to the front end page and here you can see our added trip type holiday is also added Okay, so this was an example of trip types, but below you can see destinations, keywords, and activities. And you can also see on the left side of your screen, you have destinations, keywords, and activities also available. So you can apply the same exact steps for destination. You can add the name, the slug, and the description, and also an image. And when you click on the add new destination, it will just add on into the list and after that you have keywords you can do the exact same thing for this and for activities it is also the same so yeah guys that's was pretty much it for adding taxonomies and assigning it to trip using w travel and i hope you got to and i hope you got to learn something new in this video and if you did so make sure to subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends until next time peace